moved to Nashville were hiring. I don't even know if I have qualifications, man. But maybe. Um, but yeah. So what I want to be doing with this is I've, you know, you always see those videos on YouTube, like top three tips to rank up at every rank and like top ways, reasons you suck at Rocket League and all those guys. And I don't think they address the issue in a 10 minute video with enough detail. So what I want to do with this is show the journey step by step. And I'm sure other people have done this, but I haven't seen it for Rocket League yet. Not that I've looked, but what I want to do is show it step by step every like the actual grind and stuff like that so i'm not going to be sitting here in bronze fucking freestyling all over the kids that i'm playing against because that's not fair we'll climb way too fast and, it, and it's not value added so this is going to be a 2v2 solo queue are you going to make this a youtube thing i'm going to be uploading the raw footage of this to youtube yeah so the idea is that i place just slightly better than every rank i'm at and while i'm doing it i'm explaining what i'm doing so the first ones aren't going to be too helpful for most of the gents in my chat right now um but you know, we'll be able to, I'm basically just going to title it like, you know, I don't have a name for the series, but like rank up session one and then starting division and ending division or starting rank and ending rank of, of the hour long sesh. So I'm going to be trying to provide value added con uh, content all the way through this. Um, it's funny because the queue times in bronze are almost as long as the queue times for like a champ three and solo standard dab. It's crazy. And most of the time, actually, you know what? I forgot to do this. Oh, crossplat is enabled on this account. Okay. So I'm going to be playing with PS4 players and Xbox players. Be interesting to see the common mistakes of bronze players. There are a lot of them. I had to lose every single placement game to get bronze one, div one. So here we go. First things first, you want to start off with your kickoff. And the easiest way to get a decent kickoff is just angle yourself at the ball and boost. You know, there's a lot of people, and and then flip when you get to it. This is the this is easy. And try and get maybe get your roof on it to start. You want to pick up, be picking up boost here, right? So you want to be getting under the ball. Just focus on making good contact. Don't rush it. You got a lot of time in bronze, so don't rush it. You're gonna miss. That's fine. Okay, so we're gonna keep ball cam on. Turn all the way around. We'll talk about power sliding in a bit, but you should change your power slide bind right away. If you're on the wall, if you're uncomfortable on the wall, um, then don't go up there. You just want to wait it out. So, you know, play play safe, play defensively. These guys are rushing around. They're both hitting the ball. So what we're going to try and do is hit this. Our teammate's there, so we're going to let him do it. And look at him go. All right, this is our chance. Try and get back on defense here. All right. All right, so we're just gonna try and push this. Try and hit it around people. You don't need to aim at the goal right away. If you keep it slow like this, and then once you're ready, boost in. If you keep it nice and slow, you can keep the ball under control a lot better, right? So I take it around these guys. Just take your time, nice and slow. Hey, Jamie, what's going on, man? I don't know how you're doing this, the patience. Oh, it's gonna be, it's gonna be rough. Especially because I'm trying not to like style on these kids. So again, just boost straight at the ball. Just aim straight at the ball and flip when you get to it. And then you're going to want to go get your big boost here. And you're going to want to get let your teammates have space. So you jump. There you go. Just nice and slow. Everybody rushes in bronze. You can play fast if your mechanics are there. But if you're bronze, your mechanics aren't there. So what you want to do is just be nice and slow. Try and just make contact with the ball. That's the biggest thing. Don't rush it. Don't try and flip too much because flipping commits you to a, a, a direction for a long time. So what you want to do is, if you're not comfortable with this, you know, just wait. Everybody's going to miss. And we're just going to try and roll that right towards the goal there. So we're going to boost all the way back. Very nice job for my teammate. Shouting out your teammates. Doesn't hurt either. All right, so we're going to push this. So you can see this guy's flipping everywhere. He doesn't have control of the ball, right? So we're going to try and just... Drive into this. There we go. Get it sitting in the front of the car and then just roll it right in like that. I missed your streams. It was busy. No worries, dude. You got your own life. That's totally okay. We'll push that right in, right? Thank you. Teammates being nice. Teammate pays you a compliment. It's always good to uh, shut him out. So this one, your teammate's closer on this one. So he's going to go. So you should just wait around here. All right. Now the ball goes into their half. So we're going to want to pick up our big boost here. Wait, this guy's going to hit it. 
So if you're not comfortable with this, you should try and go for this, but if you're not comfortable, I get it. But what you want to be doing is playing blocks, right? Just want to get in the way. That's what we're trying to do here. We just wait. This guy's up on the wall. Just take your time. See, he's rushing things. Everybody's flipping at stuff and the ball's not moving very much. So just try and get good. Okay, so now you can boost up here. Right? Get an angle on a bounce. It's kind of hard without flipping, but... So a big thing in the game, while this is around here and we're up a lot, big thing in the game is power sliding. If you have a power slide button, you can drift around like this and it really helps you turn around a lot faster. So if the ball, you know, if all, I'm facing this way and I want to turn around to face this, I can power slide and it'll turn me around a lot faster. So you want to practice that. Personally, the default body for this is square or X if you're on an Xbox controller. Um, oh, let's go teammate. So square or X, I've bound it to L1 or left bumper. And uh, that just makes it easier because you can be boosting while hitting power slide, which is useful in later ranks. It's amazing how well you can do without flipping or even boosting. That's exactly right. Okay, so your teammate's probably going to go for this, but you can use a quick chat saying, I got it. Up, up on the D-pad is uh, I got it by default. And then up, right on the D-pad. Like if you press up and then right on the D-pad. Ooh, nice shot by my teammate. So you got I got it and all yours. I've changed it to all yours, but it's take the shot, which is the same. I just changed it to all yours because it's a little more gentle. I don't like telling people what to do. So here we go, let's do another kickoff here. So again, we're good, our teammate's back, so we know that this is ours. If you're on the corner, you're automatically closer, so just boost right at the ball and flip at it, and you're good. And then you go get a boost. And then you try and hustle back on defense. But again, keep it nice and slow. Oops, bad save from us there, but you know, you have to make those jumps, right? But you wanna keep everything nice and slow. Don't try and go too fast until you're more comfortable with the fundamental mechanics. If you're uncomfortable with flipping and controlling your car at high speed, then you're probably not going to succeed. So again, us, we're angling at the ball here and we're flipping into it as we get to it. Just trying to get to it first, usually that helps, then we get this boost. So that guy's pushing us. So we just, positioning is super key. So you see I'm struggling off the wall here. So we're, we're just waiting right here. No reason to go in the corner there. Still no reason. We're up by we're up by four goals. And now we can go. Because that guy made a bad hit. We can follow this. Hit it off the wall. Boom. No flips necessary. Thank you. Right. So you hit it off the wall. Get a nice touch down there. It's hard for me to do this because I'm not sure where a bronze player's head is at. So I don't know, you know, what mechanics you're familiar with. But try and save flipping for when you're sure you're going to hit the ball. We can practice flipping later. Alright, my teammates still got it. See this? I'm respecting his space. I don't need to hit the ball if he's right there. Okay. Just play patient. Nice and patient. See, everybody's rushing everything. If you play nice and slow and controlled, you will climb very quickly. And again, you can use this little white circle on the ground um, to, to see where the ball is going to land. And that way you can look at it relative to your car. So another thing that's really nice, so by, by default, triangle or Y on an Xbox controller is uh, to turn off ball cam, so you'll be looking straight. This normally is not very advantageous at a lower level, but um, the interesting thing about it is that when the ball is up in the air and your camera's flipping all over the place, it can be really disorienting. So sometimes it's almost better just to take that camera off just for a split second. Nice, good job teammate. Because um, if, the, if the ball's up in the air, right, and it's flipping all over the place, sometimes it's just better to drive like this, get yourself reoriented, and then you can turn the ball cam back on. It might, it's a bit of an adjustment to get used to. So, again, this guy's rushing. We're just playing nice and defensive here. Gonna wait, you know, get in the way here just in case he shoots. Good job by my teammates to try and get in the way. Again, just, just waiting. Playing off everybody's mistakes. Boosting at this. And now we'll go for an air dribble. What do I play on? I play on uh, PC, but with the PS4 remote. Hit the GG, you always want to be sportsmanlike. Display good sportsmanship. We got the corroded metal paint finish. So there's our, our first win. So the main tips I'd give for a bronze one player, don't rush. That's the biggest one. 
you'll see every example, every game I play, I'm gonna be showing you. And when you're in between games like this, if you go to training and you go to free play, you pick your park or field and you'll still be searching. You can see up in the top corner, I'm still searching for a game up here. Go in here and just practice driving at the ball and flipping into it. And if you do it at the right, and you can do it with boost or without boost, it doesn't matter. Whatever, it's probably better to start with no boost. So we want to just get there, drive, get a good hard shot off. Try and get that timing so the nose of your car is the part that's hitting the ball, not the roof. Wish you played on PS4. I used to actually. Still Div 1. I wonder how long this is going to take to rank up. Probably forever. Hopefully not too long. So we're going to go ahead and communicate with our teammate. I'm going to tell him all yours. And we're going to just reverse and pick up this boost. So see, now they've got two guys in and they double committed. So we're just going to drive over here. Again, patience. See, this guy's just panicking. All he's doing is driving the ball and panicking. Oh, and there's your teammate. Sometimes your teammates are going to do that. Let's try and get this. Again, don't need to panic. Just wait for it to land. Drive into it. Hit my teammate with the great pass because it was. It's all about control. Rocket League is 100% about control. Part of the reason I've been flailing around in my ones today is because I didn't feel like I ever had control over the ball. So again, we're just going to drive straight at this. Flip it. So we got him. Let's get this boost. And you can check where they are. We're seeing it's going to roll off the barrel, so we're positioning accordingly. And we're just going to pass it right in front for our teammates. Super nice shot by him. Give him the nice shot. All right. Last season I was in silver. Hey man, you might you might uh, benefit from this series then. This is going to be about an hour a day. Again, we're just going to angle, flip right when we get to it like that. See, it's hard. You don't usually lose the kickoff. It's like that. You might lose it to the side like that, but that's okay. So again, see, everybody's just rushing. E hings, just rushing. Got lots of time. So we're gonna not not take this on the wall because it's a little scary. Right. Just gonna wait. You, you rarely, rarely ever need to flip. It's a good habit to get into flipping, but for the beginning, this is like, maybe this is your first game. So we're gonna wait. Now we're just gonna drive right at the net like this. If you just pick a straight line, you'd be amazed at how many people will miss you. This is very, very basic stuff. I like how you're highlighting the importance of positive feedback to your teammates. Yes, it's something I believe in a lot, and I display it even at Grand Champion. All right, so my teammates got this, so we're gonna sit here and we're gonna weigh it. Oh, this is scary. So we're gonna look at where this white circle is on the ground and try and drive into it when it hits the ground. It's all timing. It's gonna be rough, but you'll get this. And again, so this guy, he's there. So now we can, you know, push the ball. Try and work in straight lines. And you don't need to be always facing the goal either. You're gonna get blocked, that's fine. So see my teammate, he rushed his touch there. Again, just gonna save that. Let your teammate go. And this is another reason why you don't flip. In this, oh, what a shot. So in this in this uh, ELO, in bronze and silver, double commits are extremely common. Like more common than not, you just have both guys facing the ball and running at it. Um, so, not flipping also doubles as a safety mechanism so that if your teammate comes in and steals the ball from you accidentally, then uh, you are not, you're not going to be flipped into a different spot. You're going to just be able to turn immediately and go back. So we got our boost. Nice. Just drive right into that. Until you're comfortable with ground play, don't even bother flipping, honestly. Sorry, that was a snap reaction. So now we see this. We're going to try and hit it. Try and hit it. Try and drive it. Missed it. That's okay, though. And let my teammate have this because he's right there. Look at that power slide turn. Nice try. He got it over one. Okay, so look at how much time we have. No need to rush. We're good. Lots of time. Still lots of time. See, everybody's rushing. Everybody's trying to just boosting and hitting the ball. You don't want to be doing that. You want to be waiting. So see, there's your teammate again. So since we didn't flip, we're still in position. And now we can try and push this. I'm just going to lob it like that. Maybe my teammate can score this. Oh! Oh, nice shot from the teammate there. Really nice touch from him. It's hard going back, yeah. It is. Calm monitor is 144 hertz and Rocket League on PS4 plays mostly at 30. Yeah, it feels really slow. 
Okay, so we're gonna say all yours because your teammate's probably just gonna go for it. Now we just reverse into this boost. A double miss, so now we're gonna want to cover the net because you see this guy driving. Oh, look at him. This might fool you, but don't let it. Just stay nice and grounded. He can't do it. Maybe get a nice hard hit there. And look at that. I got another tip that's super helpful when you're, uh... Same here, it's so hard going back. Yeah, no, I have some buddies who like to play. And we play, so here's the crazy thing. I have a buddy who plays PS4, and he likes to come over and play. So again, just drive straight at the ball, flip when you get to it. Just make sure you're making contact, and it's probably going to be okay. Okay. Um, but yeah, I have a friend who plays PS4. Just get a nice hard hit out of here. Work the boost in. Um, he, is, he plays PS4, but he plays on 90 FOB. Ooh, nice try. Close one. Um, he plays on 90 FOB. So on split screen, I'm on 110 FOB. Oops. So this is where power sliding is really good. Because I can just do something like that, right? But he plays 90 FOB versus 110 FOB on split screen. It's awful. It easy deeks. Nice, dude. You prefer PS4? That's cool, man. All right, so we're ahead 6-0, so no reason to be rushing this. My teammate's doing the aggressing. This is good. You know, we're just going to let him play. We're not even going to worry about rotations. Maybe we can get this. Again, just watching that circle on the ground, trying to see when the ball's going to land. One thing that I, that I used to struggle with when I was a new player was um, how to turn when I have ball cam on. So again, drive straight. You want to hit it. Hit it with your car. <laughs> that guy's giving up. So we don't need to worry about this because nobody's going to cut in on it. It's all about being patient. Patience, patience. So see, look at that guy. He's just rushing. He doesn't have any idea what he's doing. We're just going to push this. We're just going to push this right at the net like that. It's that easy. That's the big one right there. Push, 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 push. If the ball is bouncing, try and let it hit the hit the nose of your car on top, like hit where the headlights are, and it'll roll in front of you if it's bouncing. Nice win. Alright, so my teammate's there. He's going to turn on it. We don't need to rush. Oh, baby. Ooh, close one. Right, so now we wait. We're just gonna block this with our car. Turn back. Get in the guy's way. Oh. So the other thing that's important, I should have been able to make that play there, so I'm gonna say my fault and apologize. That way my teammate doesn't feel like I'm gonna blame him. And he knows that I'm taking responsibility for my mistakes. Super important. DJ97, thank you for the follow, dude. Welcome to the stream. Welcome to the city. So again, my teammate's got that look at him, fast he's speedy okay so we're gonna try and beat this guy there and again just nice and slow boom easy peasy you prefer ps4 much you go on ps4 much no not really um my name actually on ps4 is what my name is on here i this i'm on steam right now but i decided to name this account uh, my ps4 name father legend great streams thank you dude i appreciate that so we're going to let our teammate go for that because he's probably going to anyway. Right, so this is going to bounce. So we're not... you got to just learn the position. So let's try a little jump. There we go. Yeah! My teammate's insane. And boost right at the ball and flip when you get there. Try and, you want to be, oh, I'm dead. You want to be trying to get your roof on the ball. So for those who don't know, if we're looking at the car, there are a bunch of hitboxes, different ones. The nose is the strongest, it hits the hardest. Your butt is the second strongest, but that's not really part of the game too much. Your your roof is the, uh, is the third strongest, and then the bottom of your car is the weakest. So you want to try avoid hitting it um, with the bottom of your car as much as possible. And look at that, we're Bronze Division 2, we're getting there. So one of the things I used to struggle with was knowing which way to turn. Um, 
So one thing that's nice is go into training, drive away from the ball, and then try and get back to it. You can mix in your power slides with it, stuff like that. Hit it around, you know, drive away from it, and then try and figure out how to turn back into it as quickly as possible. Because I know that the reverse controls when your car is this way are a little bit weird at first. So that's one way to practice it. And like I said, if the ball's bouncing like this, just let it land on the front of your car and it'll eventually roll. And then you can add speed. But again, we're all about control. Control first, right? Nice and slow. You wanna be able to do that. What's your PSN? Uh, Father Legend, all one word. Feel free to add me, boys. I'm not on very much and I'm not on Rocket League at all on PS4, but you guys can add me if you want, no big deal. All right, so our teammate's on the corner, so he's got it, he's much closer. There's no way we can get to the ball faster than him, so we say all yours. Oh, okay. So we just need to be getting in the way of his shots. Again, everybody's going to be playing really a lot faster than they're comfortable with. So we're gonna let my teammate go for this because he's there. Oof. Got that save off. We're just trying to stay in the way of the ball. Okay, nice. We're gonna get our push going. There we go, nice. You just gotta wait for your chances. This is important. You can experiment with flips and stuff like that. Um, and it's definitely good to, to try and, you know, um, get comfortable with them. But the first thing you want to be comfortable with is just pushing the ball around with your car and making making solid contact. So we're going to try and get, try and get this. Push it up the wall. So the other thing is you also don't need to be scoring all the time. We could boost back to our net here. Oh. So he missed. We put on our brakes. Oh, so again, everybody's just panicking and pushing and slamming into the ball as hard as they can. But we don't need to. We're better than that. We're getting out of bronze. Jump, little jump shot. Ooh, nice. Now we're just waiting. No reason to go in there. We're up a goal. We don't need to score anything. The only thing that can happen there. Okay, we're gonna go. We're gonna go ahead and retreat. The only thing that can happen when the ball's stuck in the corner like that is uh, my teammate's got. All right, we're gonna see if we can fix this. No, he's got it. Ooh, nice try. So if you wanna change the direction of the ball, you have to hit it with the corners of it. You can't hit it with, with the face. Just jump it again in the way. So we're just gonna push this. Nice try. So Fritz is there. All right, we got a bump on our opponent there just to oh, save a goal. So we're good again. Nice and slow. Nice and slow. Controlled. Push it up the wall. We don't... The best thing to do usually is to feather boost. So get used to doing that, what I just did right there. Because that's the best way you're going to score for the lower ranks. Just roll it up on the wall and over so that it drops down in front of the net. So we're going to try and catch this. Dang. Again, you don't have to hold down boost all the time, right? Dang. And you can, so one way that I'd start introducing flips into your game, sorry, I switched back into Grand Champ mode for a second. Um, one way to start introducing flips into your game and getting comfortable with the direction they send you and stuff like that. Okay, so again, I'm just gonna push this up the wall like this and try and catch it. Damn, he's got it. Is when you're going back on defense, start flipping. Trying to try to pick a spot in front of your net to flip to and try and get there. Now be careful because you're going to build up a lot of speed when you're flipping. If you flip three times uh, with, with a little bit of boost, you get to supersonic, which is the fastest you can go, which is when the camera does that. It goes like, Poof. So it's a little hard to control. It's going to get in the way. And that's how you score in bronze. Did you add you both? I'll watch you more now. Not busy? Nice, dude. Cool. Excited. Thank you. So it just got in the way there and it ended up being a goal. That's not usually common, but it does happen. So again, angle right at the ball, flip. Try and get your your roof on the ball there. And we got this boost. So now we're just gonna go back to our net. Everybody's sort of trying to figure out what's going on here. That's unfortunate. Just trying to stay here. Everybody's rushing. I can't believe that didn't go in to be honest. All right, so again, we're just gonna push this out. We're ahead two goals, we don't need anything else. So again, like I said, if you want to turn the ball, you have to hit it with the side of your car. You can't keep pushing it straight. Oh, 
back out of the way. That's no problem. We're going to try and get in this guy's way. Now we're going to go right back to our net here. And this is when you can practice your flips. Aim at the middle of the net and try it. Nice. Let's go, Fritz. Let's go, Fritz. My boy's got that. Oh, nice try. And we're going to wait. This guy's going to hit it, and we're going to wait. Try and use your peripheral vision to see where your, your opponents are as well. Jump shot. Hit him with the no problem. I just keep the stream up on my second monitor. We're going to boost right at the... Oh, there we go. We did it. Hit him with the GG as always. Do a little celebration. Battle car collector, hell yeah. Bronze Div 3, nice. This guy's run ranked. We leveled up too, nice. It's killing to see this pace of game. Yeah, it's 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 pretty uh it's pretty slow. But you know, this is how you know this is how you play when you're bronze. You have to play it nice and slow. The whole point of this series isn't me going into bronze and you know, like I said, air dribbling all of these kids and being like, yeah, fuck you, winning every game like 10 to 1. Because that doesn't teach you anything. Oh, we got that. Let's let's try this banner. Looks pretty cool. The new Paladin, nice. And feel free to mess around with your paint settings and stuff. I like the breakout. It's cool looking. Um, when you're this level, just worry about what your car looks like, not how it plays. What about the, use the art of using what a save to tilt your opponents? Why not? Eh, I don't like... You should be good enough where you don't have to rely on that. That's my opinion. Everybody knows how to BBM. Not everybody knows how to play. So we're letting our opponent, go, our teammate go. So this is going to be a scary one. So we're waiting. We're waiting and we're going to push it. So we can see we got to hit it with the side of our car to turn. Other people are going to run into you. That's okay. The teammate's going to be up. So if your teammate's up here, you want to be out of there. So again, look at all this rushing that these guys are doing. That guy's using the Scarab, which is the most overpowered car in the game. And drive at this. See, this guy's driving full boost all the time. And what's he getting for it? Not much. So I shouldn't have gone in there because my teammate was already there. Ooh, get him. Let's go, Mikey. Oh, nice try. Close one. Hit him with the close one. Yeah, this guy's fucking ham. Stepdaddy. Stepdaddy HJ123. So we're just getting in the way. Getting in the way. Nice. Let's try flipping into this one a little bit. Let's try. There we go. Let's try getting a little flip on there. Nice. We did it. Look at that dark red cherry car. It's a beauty. So we're waiting, right in the middle. Because if you're right in the middle, you're in the best position to defend a shot. Whoa. Okay, teammate's going to go in. Oh, nice. So let's try flipping here to get a little bit faster down the field and get our teammates past. Oh, nice. Oh, we're going to boost back here. First best, safest option here, go right back to your net. Gonna wait. Let's jump at this one. Oh, so now now we have a chance here. Oh boy, my teammate, he's having a good time. So yeah, you can see Stepdaddy HJ is just kind of chasing. So if you can control the ball better than he can chase it, you will win 100% of the time. Oh, we're just going to go back here. Get back in our net, get settled. There we go, nice little jump play right there. Again, we want to turn left, so we got to push up at the left side of our car here. Drive it in like that. It's part of the series you should throw in one high level play. I get, yeah, no, definitely. So what my my feeling on that in terms of just like showing off and like exposing myself as a Smurf to the world. Um, what I'm gonna do is if I come across a Smurf, I'm going to demo hunt the shit out of him. Wow, what a play. So we backed up there. My teammate's gonna go. Just hitting it. Oh my gosh, what a play. 
Okay, we're waiting. See, we don't need to go in for that because... Whoa. We don't quite have the aerial mechanics yet to go for this. So we wait. Wait for this guy. Kind of just got to pick your spots. Okay, so this guy's going to go ahead and supersonic everywhere. So you can tell, like, these guys are pre-made, but Stepdaddy HJ is a much higher rank. I would put him at probably silver. We'll see at the end of the thing. Or maybe bronze too. But yeah, like, if I come across a smurf like I did yesterday, he's getting demo hunted. So we're waiting. No, I know that looks so enticing, but you can tell that Stepdaddy HJ is going to get there a lot faster. I'm having a lot of fun saying this name. So we're waiting. Patient, patient. All right. We're going to try and get up on the wall here. Probably a little advanced, but... We know he's going to be bumping us. So just one thing to keep in mind, and this is something to learn nice and early. You want to be constantly... Tr I'm going to roll this. So roll that up like that. And now look at how hard this is to stop with the goalies. Nice shot. It's a lot harder when you're new to save that ball than it is to score it. So if you push it up like that, see how it drops in right at the top of the net. That's what you want to be doing. That's how you set up a goal. You hit your teammate with a nice shot. All right. Flip. So it seems like I'm just learning this now. So I'm just learning this now, but it seems like you probably want to... Uh... Does he save it? Oh, what a save. It's also nice to respect your opponents, but nice shot for my teammate. Um... When you're on that corner face-off, you want to flip into the ball pretty much on every face-off, so I got it. I'll let my teammate know. Drive straight, and right at this dotted circle here, you want to flip. And that way you'll get your roof on the ball, which is a big hitbox for your car. Oh. We won. Way to go, boys. Do a little celebration. Mess around with your car right here. Have a little fun. Get used to some rotations. Bronze. Oh shit, I'm bronze too. What the hell? When did that happen? Damn. I thought I was still bronze one. Okay, I'm gonna uh, play this game like like a bronze one um, because I don't want to be, you know, rising too, too fast. I'm not saying I'm gonna throw. I'm just gonna put us on a more even playing field. So I'll be practicing mechanics while my teammate does all the work. But so yeah, we want to go into training here. You know, practice our practice our fundamentals. Practice driving at the ball and hitting it. Some might say you're a rising star. Yeah, I'm too good. All I'm saying is that if I wanted to go into Rocket League as a career, I'm liking my prospects, right? Am I right or am I right? All right, so I got it. I'm gonna drive right here. When I get to this boost, I'm gonna flip at it. A little boost pad on the floor and we're gonna go pick up our own nice hit for my teammate whoa we're waiting we're waiting holy what a pinch shoot misses are gonna happen happens all the time that's okay So see, see what happens when I flip. I'm all the way out here now. I mean, it happens to work out. But you can see what happens. I was all the way out there, and I had no chance of getting back into the play. This is why flipping is dangerous. Oh, shoot. See what happens when I'm, I'm chasing the ball around with just trying to hit it? I don't really know what's happening. So we're going to try and get back to our net here. Go right back. Now we're in our net. Now we can turn around. Use that power slide. It helps you turn around on the spot. Careful. Oh boy. A lot of weird pinches this game. <laughs> Look at that. You don't even need to do anything. Just nice and easy. Take it nice and easy. There's my teammate going in. Nice save from Hitman though. Oh. I don't want to just get in the way right here. Nice save. What a save from my teammate. Hit him with the what a save. So far, no score. I'm going to just drive it like normal. 
What a what a shot. Did he drift into this ball? He's being toxic. Classic console player. No, he didn't drift. Okay. I thought he drifted into that. I was like, what the fuck? This guy's nuts. He's smurfing, and therefore, I'm going to have to own goal on him. So he's letting me know he's got it, so I'm just going to drive right here. Nice and easy. Oh. Uh-oh. We flipped. I missed it. So if, here's another thing. If somebody's spamming you and getting on your nerves you don't want to deal with it anymore, press start. Go to this. I just find his name and give him the old mute. And now we don't have to listen to that stupid face anymore. Alright. Be nice and careful. We're going to look around. Jump. This guy's definitely, this guy's definitely not a bronze player. He could get attracted an audience of lower level players if they knew you were streaming. Maybe. Holy moly. I'm gonna hit it. I do a little jump. Dang. This guy's still trying to hit me. Oh, my bad. I made a mistake there, so I'm going to apologize. Didn't mean to hit that into our net. Good news is we got him muted. What a save. All right, Hitman. Okay. 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 Okay, Hitman. I hit my teammate with a nice shot, but he's muted. Dribble and flick the smurf. The smurf's my teammate, dude. We're gonna boost. And flip. Stop E dub is just okay. Teammate's gonna take my boost, so I'm just gonna go all the way back here. This kid's just dicking on him. I'm definitely going to uh Yeah, like there's no way this kid's bronze. So uh we're gonna have to take him down a peg. This is a how to climb through the ranks, also how to throw. Hit the opponent with a nice shot, display that sportsmanship. All right, so now he's going for it. So now we're gonna do. Oh. I mean, he just, he pretty much own gold it there. Not a good play by him. And that's why you don't just flip back to the ball blindly. So what he was doing was flipping back just to hit it. And he was, if I, had, if I hadn't clipped him there, he would have scored it. Okay, so we're waiting, letting it bounce. You know, waiting. Oh, my teammate's mad at me. Look at this guy. Nice try. All right. So now we're going to fuck this kid up. There's no way this kid's a fucking bronze player. Sorry. Just gonna bump him for the rest of the game. Sorry, that might have been a little bit much. Whoops.
He saved it. Just touch it. Just touch it. No. Damn it, I was trying to pitch it into my own net there. Guys, I'm trying to help you. Just let me help you. Girl, let me love you. Oops. Hit him with the whoops, sorry, because you didn't mean to do that. We gotta throw a little bit of comedy in here, alright? Fuck Smurfs, am I right? What's my fucking pants caught on right now? There we go. All right, so we lost that game. We stopped our climb. We don't want to be climbing too fast here. Oh, we got the sunburst wheels. I love those wheels, man. Look at that bronze three ass veteran. That guy's a veteran. There's no way he's bronze three. But anyway, you now moving on from there. How many? How long have I been doing this, by the way? I don't. Uh, Let me see when I set the announcement out. 5.44. Okay. So we'll play two more games. It's Brittany Steers! <laughs> what a name! I love it, dude. Alright, so we're gonna... Our teammates got it. So we're just gonna wait. Let's drive to the corner here. Pick up our big boost. Now we can... Oh, so our teammate's going in. So we're gonna wait. He's still gonna probably turn around on this. So we're just gonna wait. Wait for your chance to strike. Alright, this one's all yours now. Jump. We missed. That's okay. Miss has happened. Holy Britney Steer is popping off right now. This guy's also not a bronze player. Bronze players don't make shots like that. Dang. Nice save. Him with what a save. Nice. Look at this guy's control. He's insane! Oh my god, what a shot from Monster Rider. My acting is impeccable. You should have seen me yesterday, dude. I was going. I took every face off with zero boost. You want us to be play like bronze for like an actual game? Get back to my net here. Oh. Sorry, that was not very bronze. Me. Oh, what a shot from Monster Rider. Oh, he's insane. I just got an achievement. Coming on strong. So see, Brittany Steers too. Should have gone for that. So we're going to move up here. My teammate's in a really good position to pass. So we're going to try. Almost. Nice try. We made contact with the ball. That's the big thing. Turning. Boost. Teammate's got a really good chance of that. No point in hitting it. Nice. Little jump shot. These guys are hitting the ball a little bit more now. Still a guy's boost. Wait, we're gonna do our, our patented flip into the ball. Oh, just want to be there for our teammate. Want to be in a good spot. So we're gonna roll this one perfectly right there. Our teammate get it. Oh, nice try. Dang, almost. This is probably why I can't play ones anymore. We're going to get back here. Try and just hit this to the corner like that. That guy's going in. Get wrecked. Holy shit, this guy's popping off. Hey. 
Head notes work of a great stream. Nice work in bronze. Thanks, dude. So we drive straight into the ball. Flip. Flip over. Teammates being nice and relaxed. It's nice. Nice. Let him do his thing. Oh, nice shot. Give him a nice shot there. Let him know. All right. We won. Congratulations. Oh, we got portal gel. Le epic memes. Le epic memes. All right. So now we're going to do here... Uh, I'm going to play one more. So we're going to try and match our opponents. Uh, this is more of a note for myself because this is really, really hard to know how well to play. So we're going to try and work a little bit more boosting in. Try and boost the ball and hit it hard. So we're going to work. We, we did the push. We did our, our line push, which is, I think, a really good way to start learning control. So we're tied here. So I'm going to say all yours. And let my teammate know that he should go for this and I'm not going to go for it. We're gonna back up and pick up this boost. See, look at that. It worked. We're gonna boost. We're gonna try and drive at the wall and just hit it. Still no flips yet. Try and avoid flips if you can for now. We'll get to those later though. I know flips are really exciting and they make you go fast and hit the ball hard, but you wanna be you wanna be much more accurate first. We're gonna drive, jump hit. Nice. And hit this again. Dang. Didn't score. So if you're in that close, you can definitely try a flip. Alright, so again, we're going to just do our thing. Drive back to our net. We're going to boost. Missing that. Alright, so we've got this. This one's ours, for sure. So now we can jump. Boom. Look at that. Doesn't have to be on net. Just have to hit it towards. This guy's got a mantis. Not sure how I feel about that. Jump. Boost to get back. This guy's going for a bump. Get up on the wall. Hit it. Nice try. Good attempt from my teammate there, coming out nice and early, getting the angle cut down. So we're gonna do our thing here. Push it, dang. We were trying to, we saw that guy coming, so we're trying to push it away from him. Uh-oh. Oh, we missed. So see, it's, a lot, it's important to come off the wall with the control. Coming off the wall is very, very tricky. What a hit. Almost got it on net too. He's crazy. Try it again though, we're gonna go up. Try and angle, just just focus on the ball, focus on getting the nose of your car. On the ball, and look at that, look what happens. Getting the ball high in the air is a really good way to confuse your opponents at the lower ranks. It, it'll also probably confuse you, but if you get a hit, then you're probably good. All right, so now we're gonna, we're gonna boost. So we're gonna hold our flip a little bit later this time. We're gonna boost, and right before we get to the ball, we're gonna try and flip at it right before and what that does is it'll give us a lot better uh okay so you dribble the ball back in your corner and you give it a little space there teammates going in this is okay nice and easy don't panic make that save 10 times out of 10. i'm gonna hit it i'm gonna hit it again and we're just gonna push it almost got that one almost they were really out of position so we could capitalize on it Teammate's there, so we're going to wait. He's still there, so we're going to wait. And... Ooh, nice try. Try to just push this. Hit it again. You can try going for it again, but try not to flip. You want to be turning back and heading towards your goal. Because if you flip off the wall, it's going to be really hard to recover. Oh, what a shot. Javi. Javi G. I'm getting chirped on right now. Don't respond to your uh, opponents chirping you. It'll only tilt you. If it really gets on your nerves, you know what to do. And if you don't, I'll show you in a sec. Double jumps are really good for getting a lot of height when you think you're going to need it. Oh my god. This kid's k off. Nice shot. Extend the olive branch. 
See, that guy didn't flip for that. He just knew that he was going to get it. We're going to tell my teammate all yours, and we're just going to back up here. We get our boost. Back to our net. I just had to teach that kid a lesson. This is all about learning. Kid had to learn. Now I could respond with what a save here, but I won't. Flip, get the roof on it. Nice and solid. Now people will ask, you know, how do I know when to change what I'm doing? Like, how do I know? Cause that kickoff's not gonna be very good forever. Um, but that kickoff's not going to work forever. So when you should change and when you should look to change up a skill. I'm going to hit it off the wall here. Just roll it. Dang. So these guys seem to be pretty good at rolling it. So now we got to mix it up a little bit. we got to try a little bit more high shots. And the way you get high shots are, uh, if it's on a bounce like this, you hit it right as it hits the ground or just before, and it'll pop up in the air. Um, just after is really good. We're going to double jump at this guy. Bam. Again, just trying to get that angle. Just trying to get it. Oh, nice try for my teammate there. So let's try a flip. But yeah, so when you should start changing things up, like when things aren't working for you, you don't want to learn. It, it's a lot to ask you. Say all yours. It's a lot to ask somebody to learn, like, why would you try and learn Grand Champ stuff in bronze? Most of it's not going to help. Easy peasy. So we could try flipping into those. Kids get mean, you got to put them down. But so, there's no point in learning how to dribble at this rank. I mean, it's a skill that takes a lot, a lot of hours to learn. You don't need it uh, if you want to get out. Smurf. I might know. Keep going. Right. Getting our boost. So you want when you want to change your when you want to change your uh, your play style is when it's not working anymore. Um, and I don't mean like you get scored on twice in a row or something like that. But when you feel like over the course of a few games you're consistently losing all the time. And it's because of, you know, your kickoff or whatever, your strategies. Just jumping at it. Letting Jam Band go for it. We did it. I wonder if I should just continue this till I'm out of bronze. Bronze three, diff two. Okay. I'm gonna pimp up my car a little bit. We got those sweet sunburst wheels, which are my favorites in the game that have just come with the normal game. Look at those. Oh, they look nice. Still haven't gotten uh, still haven't gotten flamethrower yet, which is my favorite boost. So we're gonna stick with the flowers. So that kickoff that I'm telling you, where you hit it with the roof of your car, it won't work past a certain level. But and you can try and do different things if you want. But I'm giving you this because it's a consistent way of you know not getting scored on a kickoff, right? You start. So our teammates in a tie. Just say all yours. It's Brittany Steers again. Gonna drive to our boost. Now we wait. Blue fire is gonna be there. Good hit from them, so we're just gonna turn on it, do our double jump, try and get in the way. A lot of a lot of this, uh, you know, bronze and, and below is is just waiting for your chance, right? Just getting in the way. So here's our chance. We got a wide open. That's a bit of a hard goal. This this pushing thing, if you can get really good at this, 
I'm really good at turning the ball. You see how I'm turning it here. It's just being pushed in slowly. Like it's being, the angle's changing. If you can get really good at pushing the ball around and controlling where you're pushing the ball, that's like an introduction to dribbling. Blue Fire's gonna try and go for it, I guess. So we're gonna just push it. Let's work in some flips now. I've said that a few times, but let's work in some flips. We're going back. Side flip into that. Let's try and flip this out. We wait for this guy. Wait until you have a clear chance, though. Um, you want to wait until you have a clear chance to flip, though. If you flip into a fifth, what's known as a 50-50 when both cars are hitting the ball at the same time, it can squeeze out at weird ways. Um, so let's, for now, just try and stick to flipping when you have an open chance. What am I doing? I am doing an uh, Bronze to Champion guide, live streamed. Okay, so we're waiting. See, I flipped there and it wasn't very good. Ooh, what a save. Tell your teammate what a save. Want to get back to our net here. Oops, sorry. Say sorry, I bumped him. Here we go that no big deal we're gonna try and push this again didn't work oh my boys saying no problem nice I like that so yeah we're doing a we're doing a bronze champion uh, stream it's our um, I guess segment of my stream we're gonna be doing it for about an hour hour and a half a day am I currently bronze yes, yes this is an alternate account Oh, that was mine, so I screwed that up, so I'm going to try and save it. Get our boost here, and we're going to go right back to our net. Let's turn off ball cam, go right back. Power slide, turn around, boom, look at that. Look how fast that was. So now we're going to come up a little bit. We're going to wait. We don't know what's going on, so we, we you want to react to stuff. Okay, I'm going to wait for this to come off. One thing I'd advise is learning turning on and off ball cam. It's very disorienting at first, but it can really help you in a lot of ways. And again, see what being calm does. You just breathe out, relax. Interesting, I also like how you're trying to blend in. Well, it's not so much me trying to blend in as less of like, it wouldn't be a very educational series if I was just air dribbling on kids the whole time, right? So I'm trying to simulate how a bronze player would play. I'm trying not to do anything too crazy. All right, bronze, bronze three, div three, we're getting there. Probably two wins away at most. So again, you want to go into practice, boost, flip at the ball. That's a big one. And then when you do that, you can also drive up the wall and practice hitting it as well. It's a really good, uh, really good skill to have. Very surprising to a lot of people. Right. So this this should be this is a really good exercise. You want to drive at the ball, flip into it, and then follow it up the wall and try and hit it. You should do bronze to champion threes on your YouTube channel. That'd be fun. All right, so it's mine, so I'm gonna go. Aim right at the ball, front flip so your hood hits the ball. Oh, we can keep following this. Jump shot, oh nice, that guy knows jump shot too. All right, so we're gonna go ahead, turn off our turn off our ball cam, look for boost. Oh, that's a little scary. All right, so we're gonna jump at this. So my teammate can, very nice, very nice, nice clear. So no need to rush in here. The only thing that's going to happen is this guy's going to hit it and it's going to come way out of the corner. Holy shit. So now we want to get back. I want to just get back there. Try to a little jump 50. So my teammate's going to follow that up. I don't need to turn around for that. You should always be trying to think about what your teammate's going to do next. And most of the time the answer is go for the ball. So just nice and relaxed. Nice and relaxed. We'll double jump here. All right, now we're just gonna push this one in. A little flip at the end for a little bit more power. I think if this series is super successful that I'm gonna do a bronze to champ threes as well. I have ones, twos, and threes, so it would be fun. Solo standard might be interesting as well. All right, so it's my face off again. Drive at the ball, flip so the roof hits it. Very easy. 
And now we're gonna turn off boost, go get a big one, or turn off ball cam, go get a big boost, and come back. So now we're in the middle of our net, we're waiting. That guy hit it at us, we were ready. We were right in the middle of the net. Um, really good position to stop everything. Double jump. So we'll wait, we don't need to flail this. You see, nobody's near me. Oh, I gave it away there. Sorry about that. So you don't need to panic here. This is a scary spot because you don't know, you're not comfortable on the wall yet. But you just need to relax. So I made the first guy miss. Uh, unfortunately, I left it in a good spot for his teammate. It's still my fault. Sometimes that's gonna happen. So it's my teammate's thing, so I'm gonna let him go. I'm gonna stay nice and back. So just in case something like this happens, we do one of those. Let's get it out of here. Oh. So you have to respect how fast the other players are going to be. Just had to score there. So these guys play really, really fast. So you can either try and match their speed or just position better. So you see here, well, this was the flick. Um, what I'm trying to do, it's so cute that they play and think that I was in that level months ago. Yep. Oh, so see, we won that one. So we're going to go ahead and get this one. Oh, we didn't get it. So now we're going to turn off ball cam and drive back, aim ourselves at the boost, and then we could keep driving in a straight line. We could just. Look back at the ball. Holy. We're gonna wait. Nice. So oftentimes in, in bronze, you can kind of just count on your opponents to miss. Um, it's not a great habit to get into, but you definitely want to play a little bit safer. Ooh. So see, he rushed it there. We're good. Ooh, nice try. And look where we are. Perfect position to take that shot. So right here you can see this guy misses, so all we gotta do is just jump shoot it. Just just pop it up a little bit. It makes it really hard for people to deal with. They get scared and the ball's up in the air. And it I'm sure it scares most most uh, bronze folks who are watching this as well. It's hard to deal with. It's an extra it's an extra dimension of space to think about. Okay, so we're gonna drive with the wall here and just try and hit it off. Don't jump because then you're out of the play. All right, my teammates got that now. So let's start trying to work in a little bit of flips here. You want to try and stick to the four cardinal directions, so up, down, left, right. Um, you can do stuff where it's like sideways like this. Let's try a nice flip here, we got time. Nice. So the reason I didn't get a lot of power on that is because I flipped too early, so I hit it with my hood as opposed to my nose. You want to be hitting it with your nose. So something that might help if you find you're doing that a lot is leaning back a little bit, like back and forwards. Look at these speed demons, dude. We're just gonna roll this in right here. So you can see against these guys, the slow and steady play style doesn't really work that well. Because they, they tend to rush the ball. They're not giving us a lot of space. So now maybe we gotta work in a little bit of a flip here or something. Try and get a little flip shot on. We're waiting, very patient. I know you wanna get in there, I know you wanna hit the ball, but I'm just gonna double jump that, touch it over there. Confuse them. And then we're going to try and roll this along the wall right in front of the net. Yeah! Nice shot from Sneaky there. That's a, that's like a key way to score. All you want to do is just hit that ball like that. Roll it right up the wall on top of the goal. It's almost always going to be a goal. We got a victory crate. And look at that, we just made it to silver. So now we're in silver and now things will get a little bit uh, trickier. So for us folks, that's gonna be it for the rest of the day uh, for this part of the stream. I'm gonna go back to my normal account now, but I hope people learned something and we'll be back with the silver segment tomorrow.